Next race is the Canadian Grand Prix. Circuit of Gilles Villeneuve, one of the most exciting races of the season. It's uh, a circuit where the engine power of this is quite important and significant, uh, as it could be for Monza, Belgium, or that type of circuits. You've got long straights, you've got very short airpin and very slow corners, whereas then you accelerate and really somehow deliver all the, the power you may have. It's a circuit where you have a lot as well weather conditions which may change during the race itself, a lot of safety cars, guardrail where the, sometimes the driver is even touching with the wheels and touching the walls. You may have as well hard braking and therefore hard wear on the, on the braking system as well and fuel consumption is as well an issue. So uh, all that type of things are making the race very exciting because you never know by the start of the race how they could finish. The main straight, which is the back straight in fact, is a very, very quite long straight line where you are exiting for a slow corners the airpin and you are accelerating all through the gears. So that is quite an interesting uh, straight line for, for the, the engine uh, mains as well because somehow it's where you are all the overtaking maneuvers, where you are accelerating really the car, getting the maximum speed and try to, to, to overtake. And uh, somehow it's where we are comparing power output of the various manufacturers. Hybrid system and ERS management, quite important as well. Again, because on the main straight you need to deliver all the power and then you may need to make sure somehow that in the mixed part of the circuit you are correctly recovering the energy and getting the energy storage quite full by the time that you exit the airpin and you accelerate along the main straight.